YouTube, what is going on with y'all boys? It's your boy Max Flames coming at y'all again with another video today. You know what I'm saying so today's video it will be the fourth installment um, of Monster Melodies. We will be making a palace melody. Um, so we'll be making a dark sample. Uh, we'll be showing you guys some of his techniques um, that he uses when he makes samples. And yeah, so if you guys haven't already, follow my Instagram and Twitter at MaxFlames underscore. Um, and if you do enjoy these videos, please do not hesitate to like and subscribe down below my tenacious drum kit is dropping at 2,000 subs so if you do enjoy please subscribe it helps the channel um, and yeah so without further ado let's get into it. all right so jumping right into it um, I have a couple sounds here loaded up first of all I'm going to start with this bell right here the second bell um, I kind of just want to get a chord layer going so that way I can build my other melodies off of that but with this melody I'm mainly going to be staying in the C minor scale so So that's the C minor scale, um, and then once I get something down, I'll probably pitch it up or whatever. Um, so yeah, so let's get into it. So I think I like that. So I'm going to put a note at the end and then do control L to connect them all together. So, so I'm going to do control B to copy it over another four bars or two bars. Um, and then from here, uh, I'm going to do alt R to randomize the velocities. And then you can play with this velocity knob here. And then I'm going to do alt S. So this pretty much strums the notes, so they're not all playing at the same time. So. So just to give it a little bit of variation at the end, I'm going to um, add these two notes right here. All right, so I like that and I uh, pasted it over another four bars. So now on this first bell that I have right here, um, I'm going to pretty much like get a uh, kind of like a top layer, top melody, I guess. So um, I'm going to get that started now. Alright, so I think that's pretty good. Uh, so I'm going to link these two first to the mixer. Um, and I'm going to give them a quick mix. I actually might end up gross beating one of them. I think it might be this uh, first bell layer here. So... All right, so and now I'm going to start the flute layer. Uh, for my flute, I have this Jubal flute um, loaded up in contact. So yeah, so I'm gonna get something started with this. First, I'm gonna see what scale it is. It's A, it's A minor, so that's, if you guys know any theory, that's all the white notes, so. So I like that. I'm going to record that in.
so now that I kind of have a base idea for the melody, I kind of have a good idea going here. Um, what you want to do is start texturing the melody. So um, what Palace does to like make his samples sound actually like samples is by adding textures, um, effects, or little accents here and there throughout the melody to make it seem more realistic. So um, I have a one shot here, one shot kit here. Um, and it's full of like textures, accents, ethnic sounds, anything of that nature. So um, pretty much I'm just going to kind of layer them in throughout the melody. So what I'm pretty much doing now is just giving all of these sounds a very rough mix um, and kind of like adding a few uh, effects here and there. For this main bell sound, I want, a, I want to put an RC20 on it. And I'm going to lower the noise a tiny bit and change it to vinyl 2, vinyl type 2. Um, and then the wobble, I'm going to raise it a tiny bit, lower the mix, and then lower the distort a little bit. I'm going to record it into the master, and then... We'll have an audio file of it, so then we can play with that audio file to kind of make it sound a little bit different. So, um, so here is our audio file. So I think I want to pitch this one down, and then I'll make a unique version, which is pitched regularly. So. So now with this, you can kind of get creative with it, how you use a sample and, you know, if you want to, uh, you can pull it into like a fruity slicer um, and play with it that way. So Alright y'all, so that's it for the melody. So if you guys did learn something from this, I would highly appreciate it if you guys liked and subscribed down below. That's it from me. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.